Hello, it's Fifi Money here, and today I'm back with another video showing you the best right backs to buy on career mode. So basically, we're going to go through as per usual in this kind of series. So I've already done like quite a few videos in different positions for like the best players to buy in different positions. There's a link to that playlist in the description below if you're like, interested in any other positions that are probably the best players to buy. But as per usual, as I said, um, uh, we're going to be doing ones for like the lower league teams, some for like the championships and maybe substitutes for some Premier League teams and the higher up rated ones as well. So we're going through three different kind of situations. Uh, so first off, we're going to start off with Hector Bellerin. He plays for Arsenal. He starts with a 56 rating. It gets up to 82. So he goes at 26 rating, which is absolutely insane. Obviously, as per usual with all these uh, type of ones, it kind of depends on how much you play them. If you play them all the time, they're going to get above the rating. If you play them kind of like, like a medium amount, maybe once every two weeks, they're going to get to their normal potential but if you don't play them at all obviously they're going to get a bit below uh, their uh, oh, right, a predicted potential of 82 or whatever their predicted potential is but on to the next player now Konstantin Nika uh, he uh, starts with a 63 rating and he goes up 17 ratings to 80 so he's a really really good one now uh, if you're starting off and maybe want a little bit better the 56 to start off if you want a 63 rated player is good uh, right from the start from the lower league teams he's probably one of the better ones to go for uh, but on to the next player now we're going to go with Tony and uh, he starts with a 67 rating he's really quick by the way he's boy I think he's the quickest ones here and he's got good acceleration all that kind of stuff so that's why I like him he gets to 82 rating so he goes up 15 ratings from 67 to 82 and now on to the next player Adam Matthews he plays for Celtic he starts off a 71 rating he goes up by 12 rating, 12 ratings I should say and he gets up to 83 as his potential but now on to uh, the two other like uh, the ones that are going to be playing for like the Premier League teams, the higher up teams, definitely is going to be a really, really uh, one of the best right backs in the world uh, in the future. So we're going to start off with Phil Jones here. He starts with a 78 rating. Obviously, he plays for Man United. I'm sure you all know. He goes up six rates to 84. So he's definitely going to be one of the best right backs on the game. Uh, but the best under 25 uh, aged right back uh, that's going to be is uh, uh, Matia Disquilio. I think that's his name, I'm not entirely sure. But uh, Martin Disquilio, uh, he's 77 rating, he starts off with, uh, but he goes up 8 ratings. He's going to be an 85 rated player. So he's definitely going to be one of the best right backs in the world. He's got a good pace, he's got a good all round defending stats. Uh, so, yeah, guys, uh, if you did enjoy this video, it did help you out and then kind of uh, predicting what players you're going to buy then make sure you do leave a like there's a link in the playlist to the description below to other positions if you're interested in that go check them out make sure you subscribe to my channel for plenty of FIFA 14 videos coming out every single day but that's it for now guys thanks for watching and here's the outro there are two FIFA 14 videos on your screen if you like the sound of any of them make sure you go click on them and watch them make sure you also click that like button as well it does help me out a lot and it makes me want to do much more of these videos and also make sure you click the subscribe button to see much more FIFA 14 content coming up each and every day on my channel. But that's it for now guys, thanks for watching and see you in the next video.